Sorry I dropped. Sorry I dropped it. God dang it. That would have been so cool. What was, what was the reaction from the teammates after that? Oh, I was just getting a hard time. I, I'm a self-proclaimed best hands on the team, so that didn't really go over very well. Um, it was funny. Fickle at one of the practices, I one-handed a ball, and he was like, ah, oh, two might be better. And I was like, I, I got great hands, coach. And after that, he just kind of smiled at me, and I just, I just knew exactly what he was thinking. So, I mean, it's funny now that we won, and it made it better that the offense scored on the, the drive they got the ball back. But I, I got to finish that, obviously. But, uh, yeah. How much extra was, was uh, involved in this game, knowing that it was Coach Leonard's last? Yeah. How much did you guys talk about one? Absolutely. I mean, it was definitely mentioned. Um, you know, to send that guy off on a win, just smile on his face, walking off is definitely means a lot. You know, that guy has done so much for this program as a player and as a coach. So to finish with a win for him definitely meant a lot. And I thought the defense played well. I mean, they hit us on what two really big plays. But besides that, I thought we controlled the line of scrimmage and did a good job. So uh, yeah, it was a good kind of send off for him. Is that cool to kind of end the game off with the interception from Cedric there to kind of ice the game? Yeah, definitely. That, that was cool, especially a guy like Cedric. You know, a transfer. He was he was having a good game and just kind of to cap it off for him. That was that was fun. I don't know. I don't know if that was a penalty too. He looked looked right at me right before I hit him. So <laughs> we'll see. Whatever. Last that was a good play to end it. So whatever. You went to say the last one. But last play of the game for me. Are you still, are you still not ready to announce what's going on in your future? I don't know. We'll, we'll, figure, it we'll figure it out. Come on, John. We'll figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> what, what goes into that position for you? Oh, you know, just talk to my family and what's, kind of just do what's best for me. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll figure it out. What is best for you? <laughs> what's best for me? <laughs> right now, I'll go back to the hotel, hang out with my family and friends. Yeah. That's, that's what's best for me. I'll ask a different way. Is there any part of you that it just seems to be an exciting changes? Yeah. Is there any part of you that says that would be cool to be part of that? Absolutely. Um, you know, there was a lot of displeasure in how it all went about, right? And I, I was pretty vocal about it, which I don't deny. I stand by what I said. But, um, you know, that was out of love for Coach Leonard, right? But if you look at the other way, I think Fickle and the guys he's going to bring in, they're going to do a great job here. Um, I had a chance to talk to Coach Hitch and the new strength to the staff, too. And uh, I think I'm excited to see what they can do, absolutely. You know, I'm, I'm a Wisconsin guy. No matter who's the coach, I want to see them do well. You know, I wish it was Jimmy, but it's not. And looking the other way, I am excited to see what they can do, absolutely. Well, yeah, it seems like every bowl season, you guys pick some things out about the team and are able to take it away. Yeah. So I had seen like a uh, Brandon Presley, that slot guy. Yeah. He's been a big engine in their offense you took away. What did you guys do to kind of, at least outside of that one big play? Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, I just thought, obviously you get a little extra prep and, you know, you get Jimmy an extra week or two on, on a team, it's usually a good sign. But um, also just bowl games, just like kind of a want to, honestly. I think Wisconsin has a good culture of taking them seriously, obviously. And I know guys left, but still the guys that are on the field, we were grinding all the bowl prep, doing great in practice. So, I mean, I think that's just kind of it. effort and the want to was there that we wanted to end on a win and it showed tonight. How different. You guys got off the bus tonight. He was waiting for you and yeah. every one of you hugged him. Is that unexpected or what did you think? No, that's that's kind of normal. And I'll say Coach Chris did that and Coach Leonard did oh, yeah. that. They just did it on the bus so you couldn't see it. But, uh, <laughs> uh, one question for you. After a great five years, man, looking back on all the great times you had, memories with your brothers and stuff, what's yeah. one thing you're going to remember, man? Oh, uh, I'm going to remember rooming with Alex Smith and having to throw pillows at him because he snores every single night before the game. <laughs> that's going to be my favorite memory. <laughs>